Hi, this is Mukul, and today I am going to show you extremely beautiful chess game played between Hikaru Nakamura and Loic Van Veli. This game is from Rising Stars Tournament played in Amsterdam, Netherlands. It was played in the year 2010. Hikaru Nakamura had white pieces and he started with e4. Loic Veli played c5, Sicilian defense. Knight to f3, d6, d4, c takes on d4, knight takes on d4, knight to f6, attacking the pawn, knight to c3, defending, and a6, knight dwarf variation of Sicilian defense, bishop to g5, attacking the knight, bishop to, sorry, knight to d7, Defending the knight. F4. Queen to b6. Attacking the pawn on b2. And how do you save the pawn? Rook to b1 comes to mind. Or perhaps b3. But Hikaru Nakamura was not worried of the pawn. He played queen to d2 and black happily captured the pawn but you know what happened the black lady became a target especially of the two knights rook to b1 was played attacking the queen queen goes to a3 and this horse on c3 is shouting hey hikaru i want to sit on d5 but the black horse he will chop me if I go there. So Nakamura killed the knight on f6. Knight takes bishop. e5 trying to kick the knight. d takes on e5. f takes on e5. And this horse had to move to d7 allowing white to play knight to d5. Now, the two horses are really very close to the black king. So, the king's wife decided to go back and take care of her husband, trying to kill the knight on d5. But we have knight to b3. The knight is attacking the queen. But at the same time, queen is defending the knight. So, queen goes back to c6. Knight to a5, again attacking the queen. Queen had to move again to c5. Knight takes on b7. And black played queen to c6. This knight is attacking the queen. And the best move will be to take the knight. If black captures the knight, then he will be in a position to draw the game. Let's see what happens if bishop takes knight. Then rook takes bishop, rook to c8, bishop takes on a6, queen to c6 attacking bishop, rook to a7 defending, rook to b8, c4 e6 attacking the knight bishop to b5 attacking the queen rook takes bishop knight to c7 check for king king and the rook king goes to d8 pawn takes rook attacking the queen queen to e4 check king to d1 queen to b1 check queen to c1 queen to d3 queen to d2 defending queen to b1 Queen to c1, queen to d3 check again and we have a draw like this but black missed the move and in a panic mode played queen to c6 and you know what white played a move and black resigned please pause the video and try to find the winning move 
it is not that difficult it is easy rook to b6 attacking the queen didn't i tell you queen became a target first of the two horses and now of the rook but why did black resign black king thought that his wife had enough torture for the day so he decided to go back to his palace with his wife and rest okay let's check if queen takes rook then knight takes queen and we can stop here but what if knight takes rook then knight to f6 check and if e takes knight then queen to d8 checkmate in this position anyways it's going to be checkmate i hope you enjoyed watching this video i wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now by the way what do you think of ikaru nakamura what do you think of this game and what do you think of his two brave knights i'm sure they were great goodbye